Morning, afternoon, and evening of, of where the hell ever you are. I, uh, my name is is JT, or or you can call me Big Boy, One Big Boy, JT. That is totally up to you. I am starting something new. Uh, with this, <laughs> this would be a YouTube channel. Funny enough, that's what you're watching it on. This YouTube channel, I have never. Uh, I've always wanted to do it. I've always wanted to do something alongside YouTube and, and I uh, have always watched big YouTubers all my life and played games all my life. And, and for example, you know, the big names like PewDiePie and Syndicate and Markiplier and all of those names there, you know, the, those big names uh, um, that have inspired me over the years to, to try and mo motivate myself to do a video. And I just, you know, I didn't have the equipment nor did I have, you know, the motivation to do it. I, I've, you know, I've always been stuck in a job, busy. I've got things to do, people to see, and whatever. But I feel like this could be something new. I, um, I should probably start off by introducing myself a little bit. A little bit. Yep, 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 yep. Fuck! I should probably start by introducing myself a bit better. My name is JT. I, I'm from the south of England, as you can tell probably by my accent. It's gross, yeah, I guess. This is just, you know, I, I'm into music. Uh, my, my two biggest hobbies at the moment are music and motorbikes. I love motorbikes. I love doing stupid shit on motorbikes. I won't go into that because I'll probably end up... Yeah, we won't go into it. Everyone has told me in the past, you should do YouTube. You should do YouTube. You've got the entertainment for it. People think that you're funny. In my head, no. But I am here today to give this a go. Um, and I feel like one of the, you know, one of the big subjects I want to, I want to speak about is, is mental health. Before we do that, I just want to say there's, this is just a quick, uh, free fall quick scope match. Uh, well, to me, it was a quick scope match. It was just, yeah, I, I, uh, I get bored of using the SMGs and the, uh, the, you know, the, the ARs and stuff because I'm just, I just suck at them. I just, I really do. It's the only gun that I can use on, on fucking Modern Warfare is, is a, uh, is a sniper, clearly. At the end, you're just going to see, for example, uh, just a few funny clips that I, you know, and just a few wins and, and uh, just a, just an odd couple clips that I, and I just enjoy watching back. I, I've got YouTube clips uh, on my other channel, but I haven't really uploaded them to the public. It, it, it was not really one uh, like a thing that I was going to do. It was simply there just to watch with friends. Uh, but changing the subject, um, the reason I'm making this today is because I really, you know, I finally got the motivation to sit there, make a video, do a quick edit, and get it done as my first ever video. And and it's something I've wanted to do for years. And I suppose that moves on to the next subject of, of uh, mental health. And uh, I, I've recently uh, left my job. I, I was just not enjoying it. I was waking up every single day, uh, especially working from home, just having issues uh, with technical system, like technical issues on the system and, and stuff like that. And just my own head as well was not in the best place. And that's why I'm kind of, you know, I said to myself today, if I'm going to do one thing when I when I hand my resignation in, I, I'm going to make a YouTube video. Um, and see how it goes and, and I'm proud of myself for, for literally getting up doing it sitting here trying to make an edit <laughs> and and just yeah just trying to get this a thing now but this might end up being just the one video and never again and if it doesn't work like that that's you know that's that's how it goes mental health everyone knows that it's extremely hard to speak about with mental health, you, a lot of people tend to not speak out to the to people because they just want to hide it to themselves. Uh, anyone can come up to you and tell you, "Yeah, look, you need to you need to speak to someone about this because uh, it's going to affect you in the future and all of that stuff." Is anyone can tell you that, but it's up to you and what you do and how you perceive it. And I promise you, no matter how low of a position that you're in right now, shit always does get better. And I've been in, you know, positions where I'm like, yeah, I don't really want to do this anymore. I'm feeling low as hell. And, and I'm lucky enough to have the support that, uh, to, you know, to help me through that. But some people don't. 
some people don't have that support and with this anyone can tell you you need to speak out but speaking out is genuinely one of the best things be it, be it to a close friend a family member a work colleague if you're struggling with work you shouldn't have to live in silence and suffer in silence for for your mental health and i you know i urge anyone who's going through any shit, any tough time or anything just to to vent to someone just to you know just to make it clear just to just to get it off your chest and and just to just to speak out you don't have to go to these hotlines you don't have to speak to anyone like on family it could be anyone that you want it want it to be but don't let yourself suffer in silence because things will only get worse if you just leave it you've got to stand up motivate yourself and I, and I can't really speak on behalf of that because I, I'm quite a unmotivated person a lot if something doesn't go right or maybe something's pushed me down quite a lot and I fully admit that I fully admit that it might be that, for example that this video never goes out and uh, uh, or never gets big or whatever and, and that doesn't matter because it's something that I've tried that I've motivated myself to do and I'm proud of that and I feel like with mental health nowadays it's never easy the jobs that we you know especially in england the jobs that we have we you know it might be well paid but it's not well paid enough to get yourself a mortgage or you might just rent for the rest of your life and pay someone else's mortgage and i just think that life is too overly complicated to work a nine to five it's just this world is so beautifully and complex it's so extremely complicated and i just think that to, to work a nine five until i die is just not what i want that's not what i want so what i'm saying today is is it, if you have a target that you want to reach and you feel like you're not going to reach or if you have something that you want to do and you feel like oh, i can't be asked to do this it's never going to get big anyways like i'm in this position just give it a try. That's what I'm doing today. And if, if a, nobody like me can come along and just give a YouTube video a try, then you can do it as well. And I don't expect to get anywhere with this, but I really hope that if anyone out there is struggling, anyone that is suffering, anyone that is going through some shit that you feel like this is, this is gonna be the end of me, I promise you, shit really does get better. Just when you wake up the next morning, be it, be it today when you wake up and watch this and it's randomly on your feed for whatever reason or you just want to, you know, you're just scrolling through YouTube and you see this video, please just give one of your dreams a try regardless of what it is. It could be joining a fucking football team. It could be being a stunt rider. It could be being a successful businessman with stocks, with uh stonks <laughs> with uh with being a ceo with with just getting the job that you wanted say for example even if it's just an extra grand a year or whatever and you just want that job because it feels better just fucking do it just go for it motivate yourself wake up and just say look shit's gonna change and i am gonna do this today and i know that's not gonna work for some people some people probably listening to this like i bet you don't even have mental health issues blah, 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 blah. and trust me i know what it's like to be in that position and if i can wake up and go fuck it i'm gonna do a youtube video today and it's probably not gonna get anywhere but we're gonna do it because it's taken me 11 years to try and motivate myself to to do this then you can do it as well i promise you that and if you are in a bad position shit does get better i can't i can't stress that enough this is not the end wherever you're at it is not the end and it will get better and life will turn around for you and it turns around for everyone and i know it sounds ridiculous saying that you've got homelessness you've got people who are being abused and you've got all of this stuff but let me tell you shit does turn around eventually uh, i and i don't uh, going from a job that i really loved to working at home uh, to leaving this job has really put me in the dumps um, I am happy that I've woken up and I've just motivated myself to get up and do this and you can too you can too uh, and I'm terrible explaining this but I really do think 
that if you do have that spark inside you, you can do it. If it's on the back of your mind, you can do it. If it's subconsciously there and you're just thinking about it every single day, whether it be for five seconds, a minute, 20 minutes, an hour, or whatever, take that time, grasp it, and just fucking do it. And I sound like fucking Shia LaBeouf right now. <laughs> From a nobody to the public of, of whoever's watching this, please just give it a go, whatever it may be. Just please give it a go and see if it's right for you. And if it's not right for you, you, you be proud of yourself for trying that. Because you should be. This is my video. My name is JT. Thanks for watching. Over and, and out or something like that. <laughs>